It's it's very hard to get pressure on this team. It's so hard to get pressure on them. They just pick you apart. They, and, and it looks like that's what they're doing again today. And there's the goal. You know, it is an outside shot, but I believe that we have a chance to maybe win the league. It's a slight chance. It's it's not big. Let's go ahead, get into it, and you guys can see what I'm talking about. Click at a button. Your face cam's still on, Brett. Turn it off. Bye-bye. Okay, um, yeah. We've dropped down to fourth, right? I know you're like, Brack, you just said that there's a chance you might win the league. The, damn it, there's still a chance we might win the league, okay? Uh, that being said, it, it's a very small chance. I don't think it's going to happen. And as you can tell, you might be able to tell, I've changed my skin up. We're actually going with the FM Enhanced skin a little bit. I was looking into some of the stuff about uh, the player screen, and I, li I, I liked it a little bit better than what I was using. I still like the Dark Polish res uh, skin, but I'm going to test this out for a little bit. Uh, yeah, we Feyenoord has jumped us as well, as you can see. We drew against Camber. Let a late goal affect us as well. 78th minute. Uh, Fleming put out a 7.1. I ended up playing no-no in this match. It was probably a little bit of a, a mistake. And uh, yeah, it ended up costing us. 1-1. That was the only match we've played. Uh, so I'm not really going to do a recap on it because I'm, I'm excited about today's episode. I really am. I want to get into these matches. Hopefully you guys are excited about them as well. We're going up against Feyenoord uh, up first and then Hervine after that. If we get six points. And Eindhoven don't do anything. They lose both of their matches. Then we might, you know, obviously a lot of stuff has to happen. And I don't think it's going to, but it's a big one today. It is a big matchup, Feyenoord, as I mentioned. Uh, IX has already qualified for the uh Europa League. I believe that's what happens when you win the Dutch Cup. Is that what happens when you win the Dutch Cup? This confuses me. I do apologize. Yeah, Europa League. So uh, they've already qualified for the Europa League. Jesus, Murphy, break the Europa League. Uh, if, the, if the table stays like it is, uh, we should be fine, right? I don't think we'll have to go to the playoffs. Could be wrong on that. Could be very wrong. But I believe we qualify for the playoffs. Or we qualify for the Conference League is what I'm trying to say. Because they've qualified for the Champions League. Or no, they've qualified for the Conference League. Jesus, Murphy, this gets confusing. This When, you, when you're when you in this third and fourth spot, it's so damn confusing. I do apologize. But what I'm trying to say is I don't think there's a realistic chance of us not, not playing in the playoffs. <laughs> Maybe that makes sense. I highly doubt it. But uh, yeah, here we are. And I want to go over something. You know, we, we've been wondering about Alex. I, I, I've done some research on it. We signed him when he was 19, right? From what I can gather, where is he? Since he was born in June, you have to be born in July for you to be 19 and then get able to be trained in the nation. Since he was born in June, I don't think that's going to happen. That being said, right, we're not going to make a move on him yet. Uh, we're going to let his contract expire when it happens. I, I mean, not expire. We're going to wait a little bit later on until his contract's closer to expiring, with, expiring, which is at the uh, in, in 2027. So uh, we're not going to not going to do anything. We, we will eventually try to sell him a little bit closer to that time, though. But unfortunately, yeah, I made a little bit of a mistake with that. And I do want to go ahead and make a make a little bit of a note. I've done it again, but uh, it's it's not as bad because the birthday falls in the right category. I, I, I'm really struggling, guys. Uh, Pierce Long, we purchased from Luton uh, on a free, but he's born after July. So he should be able to be trained in nation. OK, so I just want to make that aware. You know, it was a free. Don't worry about it. We'll deep, we'll dive deeper off into that guy a little bit later on. And uh, I did sell Howling to Standard Liège for one hundred five thousand, which is a massive profit, right? It's a massive profit. We brought him in for a free. We end up making a little bit of profit off of him. I uh, definitely does not hurt to do that. That being said, guys, it's time for the Feyenoord match. I am excited about this one. Let's freaking go. Let's get this done. Uh, I haven't really picked a side though. So that being said, we want Mosinho on the bench, obviously. 
Uh, Torrey Burley played bad in the last match. Played really poor in the last match. I'm going to give Ismar a start. Uh, let a young player that I really like, let him have an opportunity. Uh, and I think this is what we're going to roll with. We got Ole and go back for of Van Roy, Alex Delgado, and Sola. In the midfield, Chavi, hey, Samari, right-hand side is Sola. Left-hand side is Mar. Up top, it's your boy, Fleming. That's right, Vanima's got dropped down to the bench. He uh, he hasn't, he, he didn't play good in the last match. He didn't play in the last match. What am I talking about? I don't know why. I'm mad at him for something. Let's get into it. Uh, I haven't actually played a match with the FM Enhanced Skin, so I am a little bit interested to see what that looks like. Uh, yeah, we're on a good run. I do like that. I can actually see the players' faces. So it's easier to find people. I do like that. That's okay. This is nice. I, I'm digging the... Uh, this feels like it's, it's it's well done. You know what I'm saying? Like I, I, I'm enjoying the skin so far. Just from what I've seen. I really like the player screen. Uh, obviously, you got. I, I didn't really go into that, but uh, the reasons why, but I, I just think it's a little bit better. Let's get in the kickoff, okay? Let's look at the match tablet. Okay, this is different. Much different. Okay, can I stretch these out? There we go. I, uh, like a dad. Uh, okay. Okay, uh, I would actually like this to be... What was that? What's the, their formation? Okay, so I'd like that to be Feyenoord's formation. This side to be ours. And then this can be the league table, right? So, yeah, uh, I do know I'm turned off, so I wanted to leave leave myself turned off so you guys could see this as well. That way, uh, you know, you guys can see it and see if you guys like it as well. Let me know down in the comments if you guys are good with this kind of uh, thing. I do like it, though. Okay. I feel you, game. I feel you, FM Enhanced. I like it. Uh, I am going to turn myself on out at this point since... What do y'all think about this? I think the league table needs to be up here, right? And then the scores can be here. Because, like, I think... Let's turn myself on. Yeah. So I think it's a little bit more important for you guys to see the table instead of the latest score. So we're going to do that instead. All right, let's do this thing. I, I'm going to leave myself turned on at this point. All right, the first highlight, Feyenoord gets us started here. Delgado does a good clearance. Hey, let's go, bud. Let's freaking go. Let's get get these points. Ole, good good stop there. Delgado, clearance. Hey, we got, we got tested on that one, my dudes. Jesus, Murphy. That was, uh, that was a bit much. That was a bit much. Okay. Uh, if you guys don't recall, Feyenoord has won the league the past two seasons. So... They're fucking good. <laughs> Sorry for my language, but I don't know a better way to describe this team than that. They they can just they play the ball around us. You know, each time we've played them, we it's it's very hard to get pressure on this team. It's so hard to get pressure on them. They just pick you apart. They and and it looks like that's what they're doing again today. And there's the goal. There's the first one. One nil. They nord up. Uh, I did like that as well that you could actually see the. Oh, dude, dope. Wait, wait, wait. I can make. Oh, oh. Hey, guys, if you guys have been using FM Enhanced, why didn't you tell me that those little tabs was down there at the bottom? I didn't have to just bring it up every time. That is. Yo, <laughs> I'm a fan. Oh, my. I can, like, watch this, guys. I can leave this pulled up, you know, minimize so it's not taking up half the damn screen. And I can just be like, hey, encourage. That's that's awesome. That's amazing. Okay, I like the sub as well. That's pretty neat. Uh, I, I kind of want to change stuff up, man. I really do. Because, like, I don't think the press is going to work against this side. I really don't think it's going to work. Uh, they're just going to pick you apart. So we're just going to lower the press down just a little bit. I don't. I just don't see it happening. You know, we're just going to get ourselves out of position chasing guys down. So uh, lower that down a little bit. I mean, we're going to have to... Hmm, is that offsides? Apparently not. Okay. Okay. Okay, he was. Okay, I was about to say, Jesus Murphy, guys. Seemed like that was a bit, a bit much, wasn't it? Free kick, hey, Fort. Oh. Guys, we got to start getting these goals. We... Got to start getting them, okay? Oh, two minutes of added time. Halftime. 
We're down one nil. Uh, pump fist. Okay, got to be better in front of goal, guys. Is more, but you know, I gave you the start today, hoping that you would you would get it going. You're demotivated after that. I'm I'm absolutely furious with your your performance, and uh, you're you're coming off. I've got to have somebody that can do a little bit more than what you have. Torre is coming on. I know it was probably a, a dumb thing to do that, you know, playing him, but but I kind of had. I, not even that I had to. We, we, we've got to start playing these guys a little bit more. Some of these guys that are our players, you know, uh, mainly on the wings, obviously. That, that's where we've had issues. Uh, we're about to make another change. Uh, I think Samaria's going to come off. Oh, man, I love those tabs. Those tabs. That is uh, very nice. Uh, Fleming's not creating anything up top. So Vanima's going to come on. Try to help him out. We're going to move him further up the pitch as an advanced forward. You're going to be a deep line forward. That is totally cool beans. There we are. Okay. Okay. Chavi is, is frustrated. That's nice. I, I keep wanting to hit instructions instead of shouts. Courage, encourage, encourage, encourage. Guys, 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 we need something here. I don't know. I really don't. This is a bit disappointing, though. I mean, the match has been fine, looking at the stats. Obviously, we didn't see hardly any highlights the second half, did we? We go down 1-0 against Fadenord. That's, that's tough. What if I move myself a little bit, guys, like right here? Y'all like that a little bit better? I kind of like that a little bit better. Let's go there. Uh, yeah, that's, that's frustrating. Hey, we ain't going to win the league. <laughs> I'm proud of the efforts, I guess. Uh, except for you, Ismar. You, you was, you was terrible. You, you was terrible, Ismar. Man, we need him to start performing. He's like, like I guess that what's okay. Eindhoven has won the league. Uh, what frustrates me about Ismar, right? Is he's got potential. He really does. I mean, five star potential. He just does not put out good ratings, does he? Trains good, you know. He's got great technique, versatile, just strongest area of the game. He's a fairly skillful player on the ball. Good with the dressing room. I'm <laughs> just looking at this right here. Uh, yeah, but he's got a lot of stuff going for him. He just unfortunately, his form is terrible. He's been terrible. I mean, we, we he needs to be loaned out in reality. I mean, that in reality, that's just where we are. Uh, the cool thing is, what I do like about this, right, the skin, and uh, obviously on some other skins you can do this, but you can just add it right here. You know, like, this is how much longer he's got left to train in the club. That's going to be huge for me uh, with uh, knowing when I can actually loan out players, get information, contract. You ain't got to go through any of these tabs. It's pretty dope. I do like it a lot. I really do. Uh, let me know in the comments down below if you like it, though. Uh, I'm not going to talk about it anymore. Not going to talk about it anymore because this might be the final episode of the season. Up next, though, we got a big matchup against Haravine. Uh, we're, we're one point off of Ajax at this point. <sighs> so, yeah, this is going to be fun. Final match of the regular season to see if we're going to be in the playoffs. Or not. Well, I guess it is time for the final match of the season. I want to go ahead and read this off. And then I go back one screen uh, to the match, like preview screen or whatever it's called. I'm not sure. Uh, we've got Ole and go back four. Van Roy, Alex, Delgado, and Patrick in the midfield. Chavi, hey, Samaria, right hand side. Ole, left hand side. Tori up top. Fleming. Uh, Kirsten's out. Out of the match. Do we want to play Vanima? I'm going to play Vanima. I'm going to play. He's been really good still of late. I don't know. Okay, so this is what I wanted to show you. We can secure a place in the preliminary stages of the Conference League at very least with a win in our next match. Okay. That, that, that was a bit vague, wasn't it? <laughs> we can at least do this. Okay. Uh, I want a win today. Here we are. Uh, not in the best of form. We've won two out of our last five. We've drawn two of those as well. And then and then the last match was, was a loss. Uh, Paravine coming to decent. Not uh, They're about the same, really. 
two out of their last five as well. Let's get the match underway. Ready to get it done. See what happens, guys. I want the conference league. He's offsides, isn't he? I'm not excited about it because I'm pretty sure he's offsides. Pretty sure. He's a, he's like, hey, look at me, guys. Look at me go. Uh, I think he's offsides, though. I definitely think he is offsides. Yeah, yeah, thought so. Thought so. Uh, sucks. Sucks for Vanim. I thought he was going to get one in. Uh, I mean, it was close. Damn. That was close. Close. I mean, you didn't even see the separation of the two lines, really. Um, I do like that it's showing some of our highlights right off the get-go. That's that's nice. All right, let's see what we got. Chavi, can you make something happen? Make something happen, uh, Captain. Van Roy hits it in. Vanima deflected off of him, defender, I think. Uh, yeah, off a of defender, out for a corner. Another opportunity to find Delgado here. Hay is taking it. Sends it in. Delgado gets underneath it and just can't quite direct it into the goal. Um, yeah. All right. All right. It's fine, guys. It's fine. Arabine from a free kick that we don't have to deal with because it didn't really challenge us at all. Nice. Nice stuff. All right. We need to say something to the guys. There, there's some there's some sad faces out there on both sides of the pitch in there. Nope. That's, that's their side. It, it changed it. All right, let's let's try that again. Okay, there we are. Just dropped some encouragement, thinking it was my team that was upset. In reality, it's just the other team. Get happy, guys. You guys can do it. And they're like, "Boss, we're fine. What's up?" <laughs> oh, okay. Sorry, I was I was looking at the wrong team. <laughs> you idiot. All right, three points off of IX at this point. So what are they doing? They they must be winning. Yeah, they're winning against uh, Hillman Sport. They got an easy matchup, don't they? All right, let's do it, guys. Let's do it. Let's get one in here. Let's get one in right before halftime. Or not. It's fine. Who wanted a goal? <laughs> not me. Yeah. Uh, golly. Oh, my Lord. Just, just passing it around. It's like... <laughs> I don't like this highlight at all, guys. Like, I, I'm, I'm a bit frustrated with how it's building up. Because, like, you know what's going to happen. Okay, we just had an hour of passing it around us for us to win it finally back. Uh, Torres worked it out here on this left-hand side. Plays it to Samari. Takes the shot third of the season. Hey, 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 Samari. Let's go. He was a guy that I had debated what we wanted to do in the future. You know, and he's really, really ticked up his game of late. He's uh, Especially since we've been playing him as a Mazala. I've been really, really impressed with him. You know, like I've I've been really happy with you. One nil right now. Uh, pump fist. Things are going great, but I know you're capable of better. I told Ray, bud, you weren't that bad, but I believe in you. Hey, playing well. Keep it up. I'm not going to go for any more. We got two people happier. Don't we're not risk it anymore. I wonder what this button does. Oh, it simulates the match. Okay. Didn't know. Glad I just didn't randomly click it. Glad I hovered over it. All right. All right. Hey, hey, I see you doing the work there. Hey. Hey. Samari flicks that on the Fanima. Hey, takes it. Torre now has a chance. Instead, sends it into the stand. Guys, we got to get somebody in on left wing next year. Like, I know we say that every year, but we have to find a left wing player. Like, it's not one of these things of like, uh, I think we need to do it. It's not any of that. Like, we we have to. I'm taking Patrick off. Solo's going to come on for him. Uh, and I think that's really going to be the only change I'm making right now. You know, because I, I, we can't bring Tori back in. I don't believe. So, so lay we could. But, because uh, he just turned 22. Oh, no. Sola hurt. But he's kind of borderline as well on that. Uh, so... It's it's a bit tough. We definitely need to do something on the left wing, though. I want a permanent solution. You know, not like I don't want to keep loaning people in. I want to bring in a couple guys that can come over. Uh, Ismar, we're going to drop Ismar to the reserve side. He's he's not ready for first team football. That much, he's made that much obvious over this season. He's he's not. He's he his his form has got worse. He's in terrible form right now. So uh, we're going to drop him down to the reserve team and hopefully call up uh, or, or bring in two new guys. 
uh, whether that be Dutch-born players that can definitely provide for us or what, I don't know what the case can be, but it, it something has to happen. Uh, we need to make another change here. And uh, you know what? We just mentioned him, right? I just mentioned Alvaro, right? Not Alvaro. Ismar. I just mentioned him. So I'm going to bring him on the pitch, see what he does. And like I said, there's a high likelihood next season that young man is on our reserve side. Six minutes of added time, and we're going to hopefully get out of here and see what happens after this. Uh, Delgado put out another solid performance, didn't he? Hey, good job. Good job, guys. Good job. I'm proud of you. I'm, I'm, proud, of, I'm proud of you guys. You guys do good. 75 points on the on the season, so that's good. Uh, Sola out for four weeks. I mean, the season's over. Vanima is five appearances now away from us having to pay Utrecht a little bit more money. So who does it go to? So it goes to us. See, what's weird about that is we qualify for the pl European Places Playoff. But we also qualify for Conference League. Right? So what happened? Let, let's go Let's go forward, see what happens. Um, we win 6.12. I'm really confused now. Like I, I'm, I'm, I'm really confused. Uh, I'm gonna turn my face off, uh, and we're gonna go through a couple days here and see what happens. Just because, like, I'm not, I'm not sure. Are we in the thing? What are we in? You know, like, like it, it's a bit confuddling at this point. It's still not. It's still not. I'm still not sold. I'm not sold that this is what's happened. You know. I really don't know, guys. Like, okay, so we're not going to go over that. <laughs> okay, okay. Uh, we qualified for the conference league. That other email that we got was just to make me scared. So, I am very happy about this season, guys. Uh, season has ended now. Uh, we're not going to do that. I mean, goodness gracious. I didn't expect that to just happen. I thought we'd have a little bit more notice on, on uh, some of the playoff stuff, but... Lucky for us, that spot went to the league this year. Therefore, next season, we have European football. And I want to take a look at the balance. Looking pretty good. Looking pretty good. I mean, obviously, we need to get some some stuff different. Uh, we, we're going to have to start selling some players pretty soon, I think, to make to make it to the point where we can actually start buying players that are decent. You know, it's it's definitely difficult, you know, with, with the amount of money we've been given by the board because I want to buy Dutch-born players that I can play on the, on the side, on the wings, that are solid players, but those guys cost quite a bit. Well, you know, I wanted to, I said we could win on the league and the chances was it was, wasn't going to happen, but to qualify for Europe, we're happy. If you enjoyed this episode, leave a thumbs up, subscribe, hit that notification bell, leave a comment down below. And as always, my dudes, thank you for watching.